Okay, hello guys so this is the infinix note 40 and in this video i will show you how to root this device okay after it finished you can install magis elpos and other model that you like okay and also you can configure to make your device secure okay so the process is quite straightforward there is include unlock bootloader Plus custom recovery and also root this device. Okay. All the file and step I will provide in my blog. You can check the link in the description box. Okay, so stay tuned and check it out. Okay, hello guys, Assalamualaikum, we meet again with Tom Bob, and this time I have Infinix One. This is the Infinix Note 40 with the code name is X6853. And in this video, I will show you how to root this one using custom recovery and, of course, using your free tools. Okay, first thing I want to show you the setting system. Let's go to the settings right here, my pawn, and we can see the <coughs> model number. Infinix X X6853 using Helio G99 Ultimate. Okay, and go to the version info. And we're using the version 2854. Okay. And to enable the developer option, hit the build number five times, go back and go back again. <coughs> And then for the next step, we need to enable the OM unlock. Okay. So to enable the menu, you need to have a trans count. Okay. Trans means the Infinix group, include the Infinix techno profile and other stuff. Okay. And you should go to the login right here. Insert your uh, uh, email and ID. Okay. And hit login and there will be a capture and then okay let's go back scroll down go to the system developer options and in here you can find the OM unlock okay. <clears throat> and you can only enable the OM unlock if you already log into the trans account okay enable it and hit enable and it will ask for password again okay hit next and here we go now we already succeed enable the OM unlock okay just for your information <clears throat> to enable the OM unlock using the trans account you need to create at least two weeks okay so basically you need to create uh trans account that has been created two weeks before otherwise you cannot enable this one okay okay done now let's enable the usb debugging if you haven't okay from here let's put down the pawn and switch the screen so this is a step okay we already create uh trans account enable the proper option and other stuff Okay, so from here we need the files. Okay, so this is the file. Okay, the custom recovery that we're going to use. And <coughs> we need to boot it into the bootloader. Okay. Okay, enable the USB debugging if you haven't. And <clears throat> let's reboot into the fast boot mode. Open CMD. Okay. And from here, we want to run some command to enable the I'm unlock. The command is fast boot facing unlock, same as before. <clears> hey. <throat> okay. Now we're good to go in the fast boot mode. Let's run the command. Hit 
enter and there will be a verification on the pawn just press volume up and done okay skip the verification unlock out succeed unlock out okay <clears throat> okay let's check the footballer status okay we can check using this command <clears throat> and from here you can see unlock yes okay it means that the unlock total process is successfully okay <clears throat> so from here let's boot it again into the android system just to make sure there's no problem after that we can flash the custom recovery and then rotate the device okay and if you use see something like this this is expected because we have unlocked the bottler and now we are back in the home screen okay from here let's go to the settings and my pawn okay like before and then version info and I build the build number uh, sorry the default option by hit the build number five times go back go back again go to the system the proper option and here we go now you can see now the OM unlock become gray and turn on it means that the bootloader has been unlocked okay okay let's enable USB debugging again because we want to boot it into the fast boot, boot again and from here enable the allow the USB debugging again okay and now we want to boot it into the Let's put again. Hey, okay. ADB reboot boot loader. Okay, and from here we want to flash the custom recovery. Okay, <clears throat> made no mistake. The command is fast boot space flash space vendor underscore boot. Okay, don't flash into the recovery partition because it will make your device break okay and then we're going to use this one this is the latest custom recovery okay best boot space flash space vendor underscore boot hit enter okay from here Type fast boot space reboot and after you hit enter press the follow up okay enter follow up just press and hold the follow up until it goes to the orange fox okay and here we go now we have orange fox on our pond yeah, and it's always a good idea to back up your main baseband. So let's go to the backup menu right here. New backup. Get the gear icon and the build compression for a smaller size. And we're going to back up the boot image. <clears throat> MVC FGN, Vdata, and VRAM, Persist, Persistent, Protect, Protect F. And that's all. Okay. Just bunch of stuff is usually contain the email and best band. So if there's something wrong, we can always just store the file. Okay, swipe it. <coughs> and later we need to and later we need the original boot image to root our device. Okay, from here just reboot system. And now we are in the home screen again. From here uh find the file manager. Okay, find manager, browse, go to my pawn right here, and you can see I already have my just APK. Let's install the apps, give it permission, install from here, done, go back, <clears throat> and if you get to the orange fox folder we created before, back up serial number and this one okay i want to copy this one copy 
let's put it in here go back <clears throat> and let's rename the file get okay, right click more rename okay let's rename into the boot dot mg uh, is it okay done now let's open magis <coughs> from here hit install select and patch file and select the boot image that we just already uh, rename this one let's go wait until it finish and when it finish it will create it into the download folder okay okay nice can find it using the file manager from the download folder right here okay we're going to use this one to uh, root our device okay now from here we want to go to the custom recovery again let's turn it off power off and wait until it's completely turn off from here let's put it into the custom recovery again okay simply by pressing the film up and power button at the same time when the infinix logo show up uh, release the power button okay pull them up power button press and hold until you see the infinix okay release and still press the film up okay keep pressing and here we go and from here go to the file okay and navigate to the download folder find the magic pad select the boot partition and select class to bot slot okay swipe it finish reboot system we're back now let's open the magis like usual for the first time it will require additional setup just hit ok and it, it will automatically reboot in five seconds and when it finishes reboot let's open the magis again and you can see now we have successfully installed magis okay from here you can go to the settings enable the jgs magis hide sulis okay if you're using the kitsune version and it goes to the models can install models that you like <clears throat> for example I'm going to install a uh, pose okay this is mandatory for me and you can also install model for unlimited Google photo and what else model for gaming PUBG 120 FPS and of course play integrity fix okay this is mandatory some of the apps like whatsapp needs the model okay that's all guys i hope it helps you this is video on how to do unlock boot order blasting custom recovery and also root your pawn using magis okay on the infinix note 40. i hope it helps you see you in the next video wassalamualaikum